Hey you guys and welcome back to Sophia Monet Tarot. It's your girl Sophia Monet. I'm here to do your weekly readings and we are now on Scorpio. All right Scorpio, so let's see what's going on with you this week. Spirits, ancestors, guys, divine spirit, holy spirit, and holy angels, please give me accurate messages for Scorpio, sun, moon, rising, Venus, Mars, and Jupiter. This is for Scorpio. What's the message please for Scorpio? I keep seeing the Empress Scorpio. <laughs> All right, somebody in empress mode here. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was one card. Oh, the ace of pentacles. What else we got? Oh, yeah, we do have you on the board. So I feel like someone has like secret feelings for you. We have the strength card. So something may be a... Uh, a struggle for you or something may be difficult for you this week let's see what's underneath it the full card is underneath it we have the full card so it may be difficult for you to or some of you um to start something by yourself i feel like uh, with that ace of pentacles there it may be difficult for you to start a new job or it may be uh, hard for you to start something like a new business or something like that it also may be hard for you to offer a pentacle to someone. And then we have the high priestess. So yeah, something is, is being kept hidden or secret, which you are known for secrets. And then there you are as the queen of cups, Scorpio energy here. The queen of cups uh, is uh, water sign energy, but when it comes out for a water sign in particular, you, so it's representing you. So I feel like someone is hiding feelings or just being secretive about something. I feel like maybe if this is not about love, you're hiding the fact that uh, something is beginning for you, a, a new beginning. This could be about money. I feel like you don't want to tell people about how much money you're making or something like that. You're being very secretive with some type of new beginning, okay, for yourself. So let's see what uh, this energy is is about. Look, I split the deck and I see the Empress. Remember, I said the Empress <laughs> wanted to come out. So could you have feelings for an Empress? <laughs> could you be hiding feelings for someone? Let's see what this energy is about. Okay. So why is the Ace of Coins here or Ace of Pentacles? We have the Emperor. Wow. Yeah, definitely about a husband and wife or you want to wife up somebody or you want to make someone your husband. What's the High Priestess here? What's the Queen of Cups here? The Empress. And she wanted to come out. <laughs> then we have the Ten of Cups. So I feel like someone makes you happy. Look at the Queen of Pentacles is here. This could be about a business. Like you're waiting for a business to take off, a business to make you happy with the, the Ten of Cups. I'm sorry about the glare on the cards. Yeah, you could be waiting for um, money from a job. You could be waiting for... Um, you could be waiting on a stimulus check to come in, that second stimulus check. You could be inquiring about money. Like, where is my money? So that that's for those of you who are uh, dealing with a money or financial or career situation. But then let me show you. With that Ace of Pentacles, we have the Emperor here. Okay? So I feel like you, you want to be for... I feel like this is for Scorpios that may may already be in a marriage. I feel like you want your money to grow or you want to offer more. I feel like you want to offer more to your spouse. Male or female, it doesn't matter. But I feel like something is something could be over or you feel like something is ending in some type of way. With that world card, that means a cycle is completing or a cycle has completed. So I feel like these are deep emotions that you're not sharing with your spouse. That something could be over. Yeah, something could be over. That wasn't the, the message that I was originally getting. Let, let me draw some more cards. 
just to see a little bit more into this. Tell me more about this energy for Scorpios, please. Tell me more about this energy, please, for Scorpios. Emperor of the world, please. And then the Empress. Yeah. At the bottom of the deck, we have the Three of Pentacles. So, yeah, it's like it's it's a struggle for you to work with your spouse. Yeah, or the two of you may be struggling financially is what I feel. Yeah, something is being hidden when it comes to money. We have the Judgment card. We have the King of Wands, meaning someone needs to take action. Could be dealing with a fire sign. If you're a Scorpio, dealing with a fire sign. You could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. And then we have the Ace of Cups. So I feel like this wife over here, she's very emotional. This wife is very emotional. Because it's showing, she's showing up as the Queen of Cups the and the Ace of Cups. So I feel like she's being very emotional this week. Um... Your wife could be going through, if you're a male Scorpio, your wife could be going through a lot. And if you're a female Scorpio, I feel like it's saying, spirit is saying you are dealing with a lot this week and you could be crying over a lot. Yeah, you could be very emotional, but I feel like you're hiding this. You may not be showing it. I feel like uh, for a lot of you, like the passion has left this marriage. I think you got this this kind of energy last week. I want to say you got this energy last week, but the passion is kind of leaving this relationship. But you both still, it's like one person is focused on money and one person is focused on emotions. So some one person is being like, look, we need to make more money. We need to focus on money. And then the, the other person is like, no, I want love. I need more love from you. I need more affection. I'm, I need more attention from you. I need more than just money. And someone is just all about the coin, all about this big coin, all about the pentacle. And the spouse is like, no, I need more than just sex. I need more than just money. I need love. I need real emotion from you. Okay, so take it how it resonates. That's a very specific mes message, sorry, coming out for specific Scorpios. If it's not your week for it to resonate, then just keep it pushing. I'm sorry, I have to say what Spirit is saying. All right, you guys, so that's your reading for this week. I hope you have a great week and talk to you soon. Bye.